I know Patrick hasn't gone through any uh, any contact, but do you get a sense of how a guy is going to play or mesh in with a team, even though they haven't gone through contact in practice? I mean, Pat's a vet. You know, he understands. He knows the game. You know, he knows how to play the game. I think he'll figure it out once he get back. We can adjust to him as well. Um, make the game easy. Melo talked yesterday about how he was—he's been watching a lot of film on you to prep for you. Is that something that you've been doing with with him and Paul as well? Uh, I haven't. I haven't. Um, I think uh, we watched them together. Um, I haven't. But I, I obviously, I've been watching the game, fan of the game. I understand you know, how he likes to play. Um, same thing with Paul. Most defensively as a group, what's key for you all in terms of preventing teams from getting in the league? Um, it's a five-man defense. We got to defend. Uh, you know, just using our hands, our length, uh, our smarts, and, uh, you know, using our speed as well. Our when you go to more of the small ball lineups that you guys are, look like you're going to be playing this year, how much does it help to have a guy that's as experienced as Patrick to come in and kind of uh, integrate into those smaller lineups? I mean, it definitely helps. Russell, how old were you when you started playing basketball? Like Seven. Uh, do, do you remember when you started playing? What's the earliest you remember? Uh, I remember about. I remember just some pictures, and I just remember just playing in small hoops. I definitely have some memory of it. Who, who got you into it? My, my, my first one was football. I, I, really, I just played basketball just because it was at the same park. But you know, football was my main sport. Anybody else for Russell? Oh, easy. Thanks, Russell.